be talking about the announcement in September this year by the Australian Government with the intention to better serve small businesses, their creditors and their employees by changing the existing insolvency framework for small businesses. The impacts of COVID-19 mean that a large number of companies are experiencing financial distress and the traditional insolvency framework in Australia is complex, it's expensive and it's also quite time consuming. So the proposal is to reduce the complexity and the costs involved and introduce a debtor in possession model for small businesses where they can continue to trade and operate their businesses um, whilst they're preparing a debt restructuring plan for their creditors. Small businesses that are experiencing financial distress, particularly as a result of the impacts of COVID-19, are able to access a small business restructuring practitioner that can work with them to assess the debts that the company has to see whether or not there's a restructuring pro plan that can be put forward to creditors with a proposal as to how to deal with their debts. So incorporated small businesses, which means that sole traders aren't eligible for the program, if the debts are less than $1 million and as long as all employee entitlements have been paid up, then those small businesses will be eligible to access the program. So the current insolvency relief measures expire on the 31st of December, so small businesses can access the program from the 1st of January 2021. They have up until the 31st of March 2021 to register their intention to access the program on the ASIC website and then because there's expected to be significant demand when a debt restructuring practitioner is appointed to act with that company, um, then the process starts. So if a small business identifies that they're experiencing financial distress, then they can register their intention to access the program on the ASIC website. Once they've registered their intention, then they have a period of up to three months in which the insolvency relief measures will apply to ensure that they have relief from insolvent trading and also increased timeframes for complying with statutory demands. So where Aubrey Brown Lawyers comes into play is generally we will act for the creditor or we'll assist the small business restructuring practitioner with any legal questions that they have that may come up throughout the process.